So let's start in the top of the mat, two feet together, hands on your heart. I invite you to close your eyes, relax your shoulders away from the ears, relax your face muscle. Take a deep inhalation in through the nose, feeling your lungs. And exhale out deeply through the nose again. Inhale in through the nose. And exhale out. Taking longer breathing. Closing your eyes and see if you can find stillness. Take a long deep breath. the moment here just to set an attention for the day, breathing into it, and let's begin the sequence together. Release the two hands by the side, open the two eyes, and inhale, reach both arms up, exhale, gently fold forward, exhale deeply. Feel free here to grab your opposite elbow. Let the chest drop in closer to the legs. Good. Feeling the stretch here on the back of the legs. Breathing deeply. Slightly rocking side to side, whatever feels good. Shifting all the weight on your toes. Taking the belly button in. And inhale, bring the right hand to the mat. Bend the right knee and open up to a side fold. Deep breath. And exhale, gentle release. Bend the knees and step back to your plank, pressing on the toes, shoulders slightly above the wrists. Looking forward. Press firmly down the mat, squeeze your legs together. And exhale, drop the knees, chest and chin to the mat. Slide and open up to a cobra, pelvic on the ground, elbows slightly bended. Open up the chest, deep breath. Exhale, gentle release, and let's come into all fours. The knees right under the hips and the hands right under the shoulders. Good. Let's do some coquette breathing. As you inhale, arch your back, look up. And exhale, round through the spine. Inhale, arch your back, look up. Exhale, round. Inhale, arch your back, look up. Good. Let's come back to neutral. Straighten the right leg and the left arm in front of you. Find your balance. Inhale, lengthen. And exhale, crunch, bringing the elbow to the knee. Inhale, extend. Exhale, crunch. Inhale, extend. Exhale, crunch. Inhale, extend. Exhale, crunch. Inhale, extend and stay there. Bend the knee and see if you can grab your ankle, pressing the shin bone away of your body. Open up the chest. Deep breath. And exhale, release. Release the hand, tuck the back toes and shoot the leg all the way up to a three-legged dog. Good. Stay here, bend the knee and open up the hip. So see if you can start the right hip on top of the left one. And gently open up to one thing of flip downward dog. Inhale to open up the chest. And exhale back to the three-legged dog, shooting the leg up. Deep breath. And inhale, step in between the two hands, dropping the back knee, dropping the back toes to a low lunge. Inhale, chest up. Exhale, sinking the hips down. Good. Keeping the two arms up, sinking the hips all the way down, 
breathing deeply, feeling the stretch to your hip. And inhale, bring the two hands to the mat, lengthen through the spine, and exhale, half split straight on the front leg, flexing the foot, and see if you can grab here the chest closer to your leg. Try to really reach forward with the head and keeping the hips right above the back knee. Deep breath. Exhale deeply to the stretch. And gently sit on the back, bringing here the left leg to the side, flexing the right leg. Inhale, reach both arms up. And exhale, forward fold into the leg. You really want to try to bend from the hips, tucking the belly button in and reaching forward here with the leg. Deep breath. And inhale, gently come on up. And let's see if you can gently lean backward here using the elbows to enjoy a nice stretch here into the thigh. You can either stay here on the elbows, keep on flexing the bottom leg, or see if you can even come all the way down on your shoulder blade using your two hands as a pillow and enjoying the stretch to the left leg. Deep breath. And inhale, slowly come on up, pressing yourself back with your elbows. And then back here to the mat, shifting all the way to the right leg, coming into a standing split. So take your time, reaching forward, shooting the left leg up, and see if you can bring the leg closer here to your chest. Deep breath. Inhale, coming into a warrior three, using your two hands for the balance, looking forward. And see if you can find the balance, bringing the two hands by the side. And then gently lifting the chest up, bringing the knee to the chest. Find the balance. And then grab your toe with the left leg, straighten the leg in front of you. Deep breath. Try not to bring the leg too high, but rather at the same level as the hip. Open up the chest, drop the shoulders away from the ears. And eventually bringing the sole of the foot to your thigh, coming into a tree pose. Inhale, reaching up. Finding the balance, breathing deeply. Strong and steady like a tree. And exhale, gentle release. You can check the two legs. And let's take one flow together. Inhale, reaching up. Exhale, standing forward fold. Halfway up, flat back. Bend the knees, hands to the mat. Step or jump back to your plank. Exhale, lower down, chaturanga. Inhale to upward facing dog. And exhale, downward facing dog. And a couple of breath to reset. And inhale, look and jump to the top of the mat, halfway up for a flat back. Exhale, fold. Inhale, reaching up. Exhale, hands to the heart center, finding your center and stillness. Catching your breath. And let's begin to the other side. Inhale, reach both arms up. Exhale, fold. Now bring the left hand on the mat, bending the left knee. Open up the right arm up, twisting forward fold. Same again, shifting all the weight to the toes and open up the chest, really twisting here from the spine. Deep breath. And exhale, release, bend the knees. Step or jump back to your plank. Stay here for a few breaths. Exhale, lower down, knee, chest, chin, eight limb pose. 
Inhale to Cobra. Open up the chest, elbows slightly bended. And exhale, coming into all fours, making sure to bring the two hands right underneath the shoulders and straighten the left leg, right arm in front of you, finding your balance. Inhale, extend. Exhale, crunch, elbow to the knee. Inhale, extend. Exhale, crunch. Inhale, extend. Exhale, crunch. Inhale, extend again. Exhale, crunch. Inhale, extend and stay there. Bend the knee and see if you can grab your ankle and pressing the shin bone away of your body. Open up the chest, deep breath. And exhale, release, release the hand, tuck your toes and shoot the leg back to a three-legged dog. Very good. Now bend the knee and open up the hip. So you really want to stuck the left hip on top of the right one. And gently switch into a wide thing of flip on what facing dog. Open up the chest, deep breath. And exhale, release, shooting the leg back up, three-legged dog. Exhale, leg in between the two hands, dropping the back knee, dropping the back toes to a low lunge. Inhale, reaching up. Exhale, sinking the hips down. So here you really want to bring the two hands to your lower back, rolling the shoulder back, and exhale, pressing the hips closer to the ground, feeling the stretch on the hip. Good. Deep breath here, make sure to bring the front knee right above the ankle, and noticing here the sensation on the hip. Inhale, hands to the mat, and as you exhale, coming into a half split straight on the front leg, flex the foot, and see if you can bring the chest closer to your leg. Make sure to really square up the hips and bring the chest closer to the leg, reaching forward with the head towards your toes. Deep breath to the stretch. Holding here. If you want to take a full split, please go for it. Otherwise, just stay here, find your edge, and breathe deeply into it. It's a great moment to use the Ujjayi breathing, the ocean breath. And now slowly release to the back of the mat, sitting here, bringing the right leg just to the side. Keep on flexing the left leg, and inhale, reach both arms up. Exhale, fall towards the left leg. Feel free to grab here the back of your calf, maybe your ankle, maybe your toes, but really make sure to lengthen the spine, bend from the hips, taking the belly button in, and reaching forward with the head. Deep and the stretch. Release all the tension. If it's too much, slightly come on up, then breathe into it, finding your edge. Gently lift the chest up and see if you can lean backward to give a nice deep stretch here to the quads, bringing into the elbows. Stay here if it's enough. Or if you want to take a step further, you can always lie down with the two shoulder blade on the mat. Make sure to really bring the knee down using your two hands as a pillow to the back of your head. Nice deep breath, enjoying the stretch to your quad. Keep the left foot flexed. One more deep breath. And inhale, slowly come on up on your elbows. And then to the top of the mat, bending the knee, shifting all the weight to the left leg, coming into a standing split. So take your time, lifting the right leg up. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, bringing the chest closer to the leg. Good. And see if you can grab the back of the leg, using the right hand as a support. Continue bringing the chest closer to your leg. And inhale, slowly come on up. Coming into warrior three, so keep the right leg up, find your balance, and when you're ready, 
lifting the chest up, hands by the side of your body. Fix a point, find your gaze, breathe deeply into it. And inhale, lifting the chest up, bringing the knee up to the chest. Very good. And see if you can grab the big toes with the right hand. Left hand as a balance to the side in a chin mudra. Inhale deeply, drop the shoulders away from the ears. And as you exhale, gently straighten the right leg. Take your time, breathe deeply. Just fix a point and find stillness. Good. Don't rush on any pose. Gently bend the knee, coming into a tree pose, bringing the sole of the foot to your thigh, and inhale, reaching both arms up. Good. Exhale, hands to the heart center. Yes. Inhale, reaching both arms up again. And exhale, gentle release, and let's take our flow together. Inhale, reaching up. Exhale, standing forward fold. Halfway up, flat back. Jump or step back to your plank. Exhale, lower down, chaturanga. Inhale to upward facing dog. And exhale, downward facing dog. Very good. Now, inhale, look forward and step into malasana, yogic squats. Yes. Bringing here the two hands together, elbows on your knees. Open up the chest. It's a great moment here to close your eyes. Very good. And very gently come sitting on the mat. Good. And straighten the two legs in front of you. Okay. Shaking the two legs. Very good. Bend the right knee and bring the right foot just on top of the left one. Inhale, reach both arms up. And exhale, twist the chest to the right to a lot of fish pose, Matsyandrasana. Inhale to lengthen the spine. And exhale, deepen the twist, using here the back hand as a support. And try to really keep the stomach closer here to the thigh. And looking back. If you want to take a step further, you can always straighten your arm. Or you can even take here the full bind. Twisting here, breathing deeply, and keeping the left leg flat. Inhale, reach both arms up. Exhale, counter twist. Good. Release the two legs. Shake your legs. And let's take it to the other side, bending the, right, the left knee, bringing the left foot on top of the right one. Inhale, reaching both arms up. Exhale, twisting to the left, using here your arm on the knee. Inhale to lengthen the spine. And exhale, deepen the twist, using your back hand as a support. Matsya Drasana, a lot of fish pose. And same again, if you want to take a step further, you can always straighten the arm, or even take your bind, just find your own variation. Take your time, just enjoying the spinal twist. Deep breath. listening to the ocean waves. Completely surrender to the pose, breathing deeply into it. And exhale, gentle release. Let's quickly take a counter twist. Very good. And then release, shaking the two legs. And let's bring the two soles of the feet on the mat. Inhale, reaching both arms forward. And exhale, very slowly, in control, coming all the way down until you can hold, hug the two knees to your chest, a banasana. It's a great moment here to close your eyes and have a mini shavasana together, noticing all the sensation to your body and continue to hug yourself into this warm and comfortable position, swinging the knees side to side. 
enjoying the stillness of this moment. Nothing else matters right now. Only you, your breath, your movements, and your mind. Continue rocking side to side, hugging yourself. And then very gently press yourself back into a comfortable cross leg position, bringing the two hands to your chest with the thumb touching your chest. Take a deep inhale in through the nose and exhale out deeply through the mouth. One more time, inhale in through the nose and exhale out through the mouth. Inhale deeply, back to a normal breathing. And exhale gently, bow down your head. Namaste. Thank you so much for practicing with me and have a very pleasant day.